Hello, Painty Peeps, and welcome to the No Bra Zone. It's Kathleen from Cause Creations. Have you joined me today? We're going to be doing a painting. One of my favorite things to do, we are working on an artist loft gallery wrap canvas. It's an 18 by 24. I don't think I've worked on this size before. It's a nice size. It's got a uh, it can uh, hang this way, it can hang that way. It's a, it's just a good old, good old size. And I didn't feel like working on my, uh, I have a 16 by 40 inch here that I was thinking about doing a swipe on, but um, it's difficult to put my uh, base coat down on that. I've got to extend my table and all kinds of stuff. And I just wanted to come down and paint, not have to worry about all that stuff. So let's talk about our colors. We're going to be doing a swipe. We're going to be doing a swipe similar to one of my favorite swipes I ever did. And I freaked out when I used this base coat, but I used it because I had two bottles of it that were sent to me by Golden. And I thought to myself, this color, this color, I don't know if I'm digging on this color, but when it was all said and done, it was beautiful. Now, you're not going to see much of this when we're done because we're going to swipe up over it. But this is Indian yellow hue in the fluid acrylics and we got it right here in this big old bucket so that's going to be our base coat today and then our swiping colors are going to be golden carbon black once again this is the fluid acrylics And this yummy cup right here, we have a mix of the golden iridescent bronze and the deco art dazzling metallics, and that is the rich espresso. I love these two paints together. It makes a beautiful, beautiful earthy color. Now, all our paints are relatively fluid because this had some of the deco art in it. I added just a dribble of water to get it down to the consistency of my regular paints. This yummy guy right here is Burnt Sienna, once again Golden Fluid Acrylics. And this color, oh I am loving on this color. This is a combination of Golden Iridescent Copper in the Fluid Acrylics as well in the Fluid Acrylics Quartz Quidacridone Nickel Azo Gold. I hate that Q word, guys. I just hate it. I get so tongue-tied every time I try to say it. So those are our colors. I'm going to swipe with the black, and I'll tell you why. I'll post a picture here. When I pour my paints into my little Dixie cups, I then add my pouring medium, which today is 50% Floetrol and 50% Golden Gloss Pouring Medium. And as soon as I poured the, um, the um, pouring medium into the cup with the colors, a couple of these colors just like selled up immediately. I'll, once again, I'll post a picture. And I thought to myself, look at the way that black carbon is selling up. So I figured, you know what? Let's swipe with the black today. So that's how I determine the swipe color. So I'm going to get this uh, kind of yucky base coat down. And then um, we're going to get swiping. Our swiping tool of choice today is some long, damp paper towels. Bounty paper towels. I've tried the cheaper version, and it doesn't have the weight, doesn't have the girth. It just didn't feel right in my hands, and I sent Rick's butt back to the store to get the right paper towels. <laughs> Guys, thanks for being here. Let's let's make a pretty painting together. Let's get busy. We're moving through the night like we're from a different star Flying over streets and our broken hearts But they can even touch us, we found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead Ooh, getting caught in the midst of so many that never get out of They're feeding the fears and the doubts Ooh, but we go and we run to the end and we run without shame we own the game And we ride on the flames Till the morning light Baby, cause we're dynamite Ain't nobody gonna hold us down Break all the rules Let them run and hide Baby, cause we're dynamite Gonna let the world know 
We're from a different time, yeah, we're of a different breed Cause what we got is timeless, we supersede And we're holding the key, yeah, we're tight as can be We're rolling, we're rolling, just like we please Ooh, getting caught in the midst of so many that never get out of Their feet in the fears and the doubts, ooh But we're golden, we run to the end and we run without shame
We're moving through the night like we're from a different star Flying over streets and all broken hearts But they can even touch us, we found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead Ooh, getting caught in the mist, there's so many that never get out of They're feeding the fears and the doubts Ooh, but we're golden, we run to the end and we run without shame hands dance. I love this. Oh, I hope that's okay to say. I absolutely love this. Now, I want to give you a couple of pointers of why I do a few things a few ways. Um, you can see some of the, the gold and the, uh, the bronzy color has kind of popped up in my swipe line. Now, I can mess with it and mess with it and mess with it, but as it dries, oh, probably a little bit more of these specks are going to pop up. So, rather than waste, uh, mess with it now, I'm going to wait till it's 100% dry, and then I'm going to take some of my golden carbon black straight out of the bottle, put it in a little cup, and I'm going to gingerly paint this area. Now, you just can't paint the specks because the sheen of the paint will not match the sheen of the paint from the earlier pour. So you're going to have to paint this whole area if that's important to you. Another pointer, you see me put down some black paint like right here. Say I want to get these specks out of there. I put a little bit of extra paint there and then I blow it off. But when I blow it, I blow it at an angle. I do not blow straight down. If I blow straight down, it's going to bring more of those colors up. So when you're blowing, blow at an angle. If you want to bring more of the colors up, blow straight down. Like right in this area here, if I blew straight down, some more of those coppers and those bronzes are probably going to pop up. Same with this area right in through here. So just a few little tricks. Use your eraser. Use your base coat. Use whatever to manipulate your paint. If I wanted to slide all of these cells down more, I put some more of that black in there and I would blow it at an angle to move that down. You gotta blow it, rest for a minute, then blow it again because a lot of times it travels back. So it takes a little bit of effort. So a few little pointers that I have learned along the way. I love this painting. I am probably going to paint the sides all black because right now they, let me show you what the sides look like. They're not bad, but I like, oops, I like painting my gallery wrap canvases. When there's black in the composition, I like painting the sides black. Um, as you approach the painting from an angle, once it's hanging on a wall, it just kind of makes it pop out from the wall a little bit more. So there you have it, guys. Um, swiping away. It's my jam. <laughs> I am always glad when you join me here in my happy place, guys. Stay healthy, stay happy, stay well. Have a fabulous day. See you soon.